Name Confused by Enchanted Nightingale Chapter 69 A Study in Pink In Progress He watched the news with a frown on his face ever since the first random suicide happened. He could not help it. Odd things just caught his interest. It was the wizard that actually brought it to Mycroft's attention. After the first one, Mycroft had been disbelieving. After the second one, he was tentatively interested. Let the police handle it. The man who was the British government had suggested. After the third body turned up, Mycroft spoke to his assistant first. Make sure to keep an eye on Sherlock. It's just the thing to pique his interest. Of course, sir. Dimitri had replied and promptly upped Sherlock's security detail and gathered as much information as he could on the cases. Had he not known that the magical community was separated, he would have feared that a wizard or witch was responsible for deaths. Somehow, the idea that a muggle could kill without a trace make the green-eyed man more uncomfortable. He would have liked to get involved, but his curiosity no longer got the better of him, and he could curb his impulses better now. So he did not snoop, did not even try to do anything but follow the case on the news, when he had the time to do so, and he most certainly did not spy on the good detective Lestrade and his men and women. But even as he did all that, he just knew that there was one person in the entire city that would just find serial suicides fascinating, and if Sherlock got involved, then the wizard would have to be involved as well. For that reason, he delegated the task of staying up to date with everything to Anthea, who was bewildered at first, but happy to follow his orders. Mycroft Holmes found this acceptable. He got someone to watch over his brother, but at the same time his assistant was not busy running after his younger sibling. And then something changed. It was not just that the number of bodies reached four. No, it was something that happened around the case of the fourth murder victim, and it caused a shift in Sherlock's personal life, and as a result to Mycroft's as well. What happened was that one John Watson got back on the wizard's radar.